Hello, I'm going to talk you through how to make a He is Alive Jesus wooden disc. In the end, it will look something like this, um, but these are the things that you'll need from your bag. So you'll need a wooden disc, a glue stick, a pen, and a selection of papers. So there's, you should find a yellow piece, a dark orange piece, a patterned piece, a white piece of paper and the brown for the skin tone. Now, if you haven't got a bag, I've got some ideas just for you. So, um, first of all, I would find a thicker quality um, cardboard box and cut a circle out of that to create what would be the wooden disc. And then uh, there are various things that you could do. You could grab some wrapping paper, um, you could use tissue paper. If you haven't got any coloured paper at all, you could grab some white paper and colour it in with some felt tips and um, crayons yourself. Okay, and then you'll be able to follow through each of the steps that I'm going to talk you through. So the first thing that I did was take my wooden disc and on the orange pieces of paper and the patterned orange piece of paper, I drew round the disc. But when you cut out each one, I would make it slightly smaller because then we get to see some of the lovely wood underneath. So can you see I've left a little edge all around and then I cut the pattern piece to go in the middle. You can decide which order you do it in, that's fine, but I preferred the pattern piece in the middle. So we just get a sneaky peek of it. And then, so that, that one will be a little bit smaller than the dark orange one. And then the smallest circle will be in the yellow paper. And all you need to do is add some glue and the glue stick's brilliant for this. You just add a bit of glue to the back. One tip I would say is when you've cut out your circles, always make sure the circle touches at the bottom so we're leaving a gap and we can see each of the papers. Then once those are all stuck on, your next step is to draw the tunic for Jesus. So you might have caught a glimpse of this earlier. I do something like this. I started at the neck, just did a scoop, came down into the arms and then drew the longer part of it. So something like that on the white paper, cut it out, glue it on. Then you need the skin tone and I cut out like an oval shape for the head. And then to create the feet so and the hands so they're the same size, I folded a little bit in half and then cut out two at the same time and then they're the same size. Um, and stick those on so the head obviously goes at the top of the tunic little hands at the end of the sleeves and feet underneath and the last thing you'll need is a black pen or any color pen that you can get your hands on and add he is alive on the paper around the top so I made the um, le first letter a little bit more fancy, but you can write it however you like. I hope you have loads of fun making this craft.